Hello everybody, welcome to the Geek XP. My name is Brent and we are here for the next episode of Steven Universe as well as my reaction to go along with it. Now, I'm sure you guys are pretty tired of me doing these same old announcements, so for your viewing and audio pleasure or annoyance, I am going to do a bad impersonation of Yoda to make these announcements. <clears throat> In these reaction videos, keep low the volume, Brent does. For copyright reasons disease, Please support the official release. Also, if you enjoy this channel, you do. Show your support and check out the other shows and videos on the Geek XP. <laughs> now that that is out of the way, we are ready to jump into this episode. I believe it's called Same Old World. And I believe Lapis Lazuli is a key part of it. So I'm very excited for that. They, she was rescued from the fusion that was known as Malachite, which is now no more, after Jasper fell into a hole. We'll probably see her again. But today's episode is probably about Lapis. I'm super excited. And without any further ado, let us click play. We'll always save the day. I do apologize for how late this episode is. Oh, that is bright. I'm going to turn off this monitor once again, just to avoid that glare. I need, I've invested in a new mic with a pot filter. I need to get some new lighting. But I do apologize for how late this is. I wait for the videos to go up online on a site, and then I have work during the day. So I get to it when I can. Her hair looks doesn't uh, not, is not as sharp as it used to. They've added some more rounded edges to it. Makes her look more amiable. Also, without those sharp edges, the little phrase makes her look less up, you know, uptight and kent. <laughs> I wonder if you even know what really happened in there, Peridot, even if you wanted to tell the story. Are you going to go check up on Lapis? <laughs> Sleepy line. Yep. I love her dress. It's such a unique look in this show for the gems. She's got to be mad exhausted. It's incredible she didn't like get poofed when they got separated like that, that they came out as separate gems. Like with their form. Yeah, Caterpillar sleeping bag. It reminds me of Bonnie's cat. Uh, I think she has a Caterpie sleeping bag in Pokemon XY. No, Lapis, don't go. Don't leave. Where are you going to go? You're going to go to Homeworld? That went great last time. Steven's so understanding. Ah, you'll be back. I saw the promo clip. We'll see you again, Lapis. I wonder where she would go. I wonder if they can add a room for Peridot in the temple. Besides, I... She watched him poop! <laughs> Uh, I mean, I guess it would make sense from a logistical standpoint. It's one less character they have to keep on animating in each episode. That's a lot. Maybe she'll swing around. I'd like to see her interacting with the rest of the cast in the temple. That'd be cool. And it'd be cool to see if she got her own room. I mean, it would sort of mess up the... I mean, maybe... Yeah, because Garnet still activates her, needs to activate her room with both her gems. It would mess up the star thing. I mean, they could always augment their symbol, I suppose. Leon! I wonder if he shall stumble upon Lapis. 
Yeah. This is actually good. If the gems are gone, it'll be easier for him to, you know, convince her to stay because the gems that she really hates won't be around. That's what I'm saying! All coastal towns. His knowledge of cities are limited entirely to the coast. <laughs> Water wings. Yay! Ooh, cool. I can show you the world. Oh, this is nice. I don't think Steven's ever flown before. I'm trying to think. Yeah. Interesting. She could probably live in the ocean, too. That's that's another thing I really like about the show is the passage of time is very much present. So, what do you think? Oh, I'm not sure. Well, that's okay. There's plenty of places we haven't been. Come on. Let's see. It. Whoa. The Empire City. Isn't it cool? It's like a mix between New York and Las Vegas. Yeah. Or just sort of like an amalgam of big cities. Okay, maybe I was right. Las Vegas and New York. <laughs> Steven watches a lot of TV. We know what he's talking about. <laughs> What's that shadowy place over there? That is New Jersey. You must never go there. <laughs> As someone who has stayed in New Jersey for a while, that's hilarious. Uh... Good on you, Steven Universe. Your Jersey humor. My God. Whoa. I wonder how fast she can fly. Like, her top speed. Since her wings are sort of like her weapon, as it were, maybe pretty fast, I guess. <laughs> Don't drop Steven. Show us the galaxy warp. Lapis, what did I just say? I said don't drop Steven. <laughs> Jeez. Lapis is sort of a mess, but that's okay. Why so blue, Lapis? Uh, yuck, yuck, yuck. Fwe, 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 fwe. Oh, Lapis backstory. Oh. Hydra storytelling. Yes. Show us Lapis. This is going to be cool. Whoa. Her mirror eyes are back. Ooh. Oh. Whoa. That gem had crazy hair. Oh no. Oh no. 
Well, I guess, you know, that makes sense to me because I, I don't see the crystal gems being gems that would actively use others. They probably figured, you know, she's already stuck in the mirror. She had no idea. They probably had no idea how old she was. Wow. That's so sad. Ooh, the worst is like she just she can't she wouldn't be able to tell them you guys have the wrong gem. Poor Lapis. Okay. Wee. It's not so bad. <laughs> Do not try the rest stop sushi in Jersey or anywhere. Ah, uh, Steven inspiring people. Making Earth appealing to gems. Just like his ma. Super duper sad. And you guys can fly. The Aladdin song is so applicable. Hooray! <laughs> Oh, that's right. Last time Lapis saw her, she was in league with Jasper. Look how big her hair is! <laughs> and that will probably be the theme, or like the, the topic for next episode. That was such a nice, sweet episode. Definite change from our last two episodes, which were like really intense and emotional. This was just this nice, sort of Aladdin song moment in which Steven is sort of pitching Earth to Lapis as, please stay here, be our friend, maybe. Because at first I was really worried because if the, if the crystal gems are the ones who put her in the mirror, which I guess we really didn't have any evidence to suggest that, then it would have been really hard to convince her to stay. But they just picked her up and just sort of kept her in storage and then Pearl brought her out to show Steven when he was being in school, sort of. But since it was the homeworld gems who would use her, that makes more sense to me now that it's explained. And there is hope for a resolution since they aren't the ones who actively put her in the mirror. And I'd be interested to see sort of this whole Peridot Lapis thing. And that little teaser we got a while back, we see uh, Peridot sort of like offering a gift. She's like, ta -da! So that, that'll, I, I'd be, I wouldn't be surprised if that was in our next episode, but that was delightful is the best word I can think of for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and my reactions. Make sure to leave your comments and thoughts on the episode down below. Like this video if you enjoyed the content and subscribe for more future Steven Universe content. Make sure to check out the rest of the ch channel. We've got a lot of cool stuff coming out and a super fun game called Overwatch coming out that I have already put out some videos for with more on the way. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys have been awarded some geek XP and until next time, stay geeky my friends.